Hey folks, welcome to the show, welcome to the channel, I'm Captain He. How are you today? Forgive me, my allergies are like making it hard for me to do a proper intro here. I hope you are doing well. I'm having a great day. This is part nine of of my playthrough of uh, Detroit Be Become Human. I've been enjoying this game for ever since I started playing I'm glad it. to see you again. I hope you had a pleasant day. Hey. Would you like to continue your story? She is such a, a friendly AI. And Android. So, let's get into it. And uh, just to let you know, if you haven't decided to subscribe and or follow me on Twitter, YouTube, links to my my Twitch are found down below in the in the description in the yeah in the description box below. Feel free to give me a, a, a subscription and a... Oh, it's like somebody's playing with a drill inside my skull. You sure this is the place? It's the address in the report. Right. Okay. Let's get going. Sexiest androids in town. Now I know why you insisted on coming here. you doing? Coming, Lieutenant. You're not gonna take my license, are you? I, I had nothing to do with this. The investigation's ongoing, sir. I can't tell you anything for the moment. Hey, Hank. Hey, Ben. How's it going? <sighs> that room there. Oh, uh, by the way, Gavin's in there, too. Oh, great. Dead body and an asshole, just what I needed. Lieutenant Anderson is plastic pet. What the fuck are you two doing here? We've been assigned all cases involving androids. Oh yeah? I'm like wasting time. There's some pervert who uh <laughs> got more action than he could handle. <laughs> we'll have a look anyway, if you don't mind. Come on, let's go. It's, uh, starting to stink of booze in here. Night, Lieutenant.
Oh, hey! Oh, Connor, you're so disgusting. I think I'm gonna puke again. He didn't die of a heart attack. He was strangled. Yeah, I saw the bruising on the neck. Doesn't prove anything, though. Could have been a rough play. We're missing something here. Think you can read the android's memory? Maybe you can see what happened. I can try. Driver's license says... way to access its memory is to reactivate it. Think you can do it? It's badly damaged. If I can, it'll only be for a minute, maybe less. I just hope it's long enough to learn something. to know what happened. Is he... Is he dead? Tell me what happened. He started... hitting me. Again. And again. Did you kill him? No. No, it wasn't me. Were you alone in the room? Was there anyone else with you? He wanted us to play with two girls. That's what he said, there was two of us. Where did the other android go? Did it say anything? <sighs> so there was another android. This happened over an hour ago, it's probably long gone. No. It couldn't go outside dressed like that unnoticed. It might still be here. If you could find a deviant among all the other androids in this place? Deviants aren't easily detected. Oh, shit. It's gotta be some other way. Maybe an eyewitness. Somebody who saw it leaving the room. I'm gonna go ask the manager a few questions about what he saw. You let me know if you think of anything. Did you know the victim? No, I mean, he came in maybe two, three times. I mean, these guys, they don't really talk very much, you know? Come in, do their business, and then go on their way. They ran into any trouble with the androids before. No way. Friend detected. Please try again. Once. We lost a model two, three months back. Uh, same model. Just vanished. We never found out what happened. Probably 
really don't have any CCTV. That club manager's a pain in the ass. Yeah. Chewed my ear off for half an hour so we don't revoke his license. Ah. So what happened here? Not sure yet. I think there was another android. Another android? Yeah. Well, that's what Connor says. Hey, I have a terrible fucking headache. Do you have any painkillers? Not with me, Hank. Sorry. Lieutenant, can you come here a second? Found something? Maybe. Can you rent this, Tracy? For fuck's sake, Connor, we got better things to do. Please, Lieutenant, just trust me. Good on my expense account. Purchase confirmed. Beam Club wishes you a pleasant experience. You're welcome. Delighted to meet you. Follow me. I'll take you to your room. Okay, now what? It saw something. What are you talking about? I saw what? The Deviant leave the room. A blue-haired Tracy. Club policy is to wipe the android's memory every two hours. We only have a few minutes if we want to find another witness. Hey, what am I supposed to do with this one? Tell you changed your mind. Uh, uh so... Let's try this one. Better be worth it.
saw the blue-haired Tracy. I know which way it went. Then go for it. There are androids everywhere. How are you gonna tell which one saw the Tracy with blue hair? I know which direction it took. I just need to find another android on its path. If you have a better idea, I'm all ears. track again.
didn't see anything. I made a mistake somewhere. This has got to be the most expensive investigation of my career. Nothing. Blue-haired Tracy didn't come this way. This is crazy! Wait! I'll take it from here. Used till they break and then they get tossed out. People are fucking insane. They don't want relationships anymore. Everybody just gets an android. They cook what you want. They screw when you want. You don't have to worry about how they feel. Next thing you know, we're gonna be extinct because everybody would rather buy a piece of plastic than to love another human being.
getting away! Tracy. I knew I was next. I was so scared. I begged him to stop, but he wouldn't. And so I put my hands around his throat, and I squeezed until he stopped moving. I didn't mean to kill him. I just wanted to stay alive. Get back to the one I love. I wanted her to hold me in her arms again. Make me forget about the humans. Their smell of sweat. And their dirty words. Come on. Let's go. Probably better this way. Nice view, huh? I used to come here a lot before. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions, or is it just you? Why are you so determined to kill yourself? Some things I just can't forget. Whatever I do, they're always there. Eating away at me. I don't have the guts to pull the trigger, so I kill myself a little every day. That's probably difficult for you to understand, huh, Connor? Nothing very rational about it. Before what? Hmm? You said... I used to come here a lot before. Before what? Before... Before nothing. We're not making any progress on this investigation. The Deviants have nothing in common. They're all different models, produced at different times, in different places? Well, there must be some link. What they have in common is this obsession with RA-9. It's almost like some kind of 
myth. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program. Androids believing in God. Fuck, what's this world coming to? You seem preoccupied, Lieutenant. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? Those two girls... They just wanted to be together. They really seemed... in love. They can simulate human emotions, but they're machines, and machines don't feel anything. What about you, Connor? You look human, you sound human, but what are you really? I'm whatever you want me to be, Lieutenant. Your partner, your buddy to drink with, or just a machine designed to accomplish a task. You could have shot those two girls, but you didn't. Why didn't you shoot Connor? Some scruple suddenly enter into your program? No. I just decided not to shoot. That's all. But are you afraid to die, Connor? I would certainly find it regrettable to be interrupted before I can finish this investigation. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? Nothing? Oblivion? Android heaven? Where does all your anger come from, Lieutenant? Some unresolved trauma in your past? You think you're so fucking smart. Always one step ahead, huh? Tell me this, smartass. How do I know you're not a deviant? I self-test regularly. I know what I am and what I am not. Where are you going? Get drunker. I need to think. Well, that was interesting. I like that. That was a good turnout. Well, we'll come back to it tomorrow and see where this all takes us. So, thank you very much for coming and watching the, the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you like this, please Again, go go ahead and, and like and subscribe to the channel and, and give a thumbs up to the video. Thank you very much. I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good night, everybody. Bye for now.